we did what they want us to do, and it was that simple. That simple. You are so humble. I cannot believe I am at the World War II Memorial with a World War II hero. A full circle moment for military veteran who just returned to San Diego on honor flight. Ed Seffen served our country in World War II, Korea, and Vietnam. ABC 10 News reporter Sierra Encinas shows us the moment he visited a memorial made in his honor. The beauty of the World War II Memorial in Washington, D.C. is a trip 80 years in the making for two World War II veterans. One of them tells me he would have never thought this would be here today when he was fighting for our country in the 1940s. Thank you. Thank you for your service. Welcome to your memorial. Taking in every moment of a memorial made just for World War II heroes like himself. These people are so nice. He said Seffens. I was 17 years old when my mother signed the paper that let me live. I quit high school. He didn't turn back. In fact, he went on to serve in Korea and Vietnam, too. He says all those years ago when he was fighting for our country, he would have never thought he'd see a memorial like this. This, this is so, so amazing. This whole thing is amazing to me. I've never had anything like this done for me. He thinks those who served alongside him in the 40s would think the same thing if they saw the memorial today. I, I don't see how they could not feel the way I feel about this place. This is this is very this is awesome. No other country's got such a, such a country as ours. Ours is the greatest country I ever was. If you ask him if he's an American hero, he'd say, I, I don't judge myself a hero in Sierra. I, I really don't. I, I'm just a guy that does the job. That's all. No man. And I'm glad I did it. I'm glad that I lived through it. It, and I'm glad I'm up here right now to see y'all later. Thank you so much. There are less than 170,000 World War II veterans alive today in the United States. In Washington, D.C., Sierra and Cenas, ABC 10 News. Such a beautiful memorial. Steffens wasn't the only World War II veteran that Sierra caught up with. San Diegan Rudy Liker was drafted into the Army in 1945. He went to infantry training and then went to paratrooper school. He says he felt energized seeing the World War II memorial and grateful for the time that he got to serve our country. I was kind of glad that I got called up because I had a lot of family there, a lot of cousins. An honor flight San Diego is looking for any remaining World War II and Korean War veterans to take the upcoming honor flights. They are now allowing some Vietnam veterans as well. You can find more information on our website, 10news.com.